When I was a young scientist, I was fascinated by chemical measurements and intricate advanced machines, discovering and recording. With the rise of metabolomics, I found it the perfect home for me. As metabolomics matured into a mainstream method of research, I got to experience the same childlike curiosity and sense of discovery every day. Molecular analysis is detective work, looking for clues to piece together what's really happening. It's exciting when we find we're on the right track. Working with Sarah O'Connor, we try to understand how certain molecules are made, and use mass spectrometry to discover the enzymes of plants, and then track the chemical reactions going on within the plant's development. We imagine what the chemical reaction will be and make predictions. Maybe we're right and the research continues on that path. Maybe we're surprised and it leads us in new directions. We're always learning something new. We train others. We support research. We are passionate. Living organisms are made of a mass of exciting chemicals, but until recently the mining has been too crude. Now we have the right tools, but we've only just started. It's like a new world to discover. With our imaging machine, MALDI, we can scan a dried sample with a laser beam. By creating a heat map, we're not just picking out the chemical, we're localising the exact area, targeting the infected area on a leaf, for example. With DESI, we can even scan a fresh sample to get a picture of the chemical life of a real, living tissue. We've only looked in detail at a tiny percentage of bacteria, plants and fungi available. With each step into the unknown, as we delve deeper into the structures and processes of something new, we may learn how to make new antibiotics and new anti-cancer medication. The Molecular Analysis Platform, here at the John Innes Centre, is at the cutting edge of plant science. It's where we explore a world of opportunities through the measurement of molecules.